Hi guys, it's Lita. So I have a little Halloween haul for you guys. This is a pretty small haul, but I wanted to share it with you guys in case you want to pick up any of these items yourself. So let's go ahead and get into the haul. So my first Halloween purchase in store, walking into a store, physically buying it, not online, is this makeup palette from Makeup Revolution. This is the Treehouse of Horrors palette. This has the wackiest color range for a palette but the colors that i've used are great so far i paid ten dollars for this palette i think they gave me the wrong price because it didn't have a price on it so yeah if you guys want me to swatch this palette for you i can definitely do that just leave a comment down below and we will do a swatchy swatch but i recommend this palette the colors that i've tried so far have been super pigmented with little to no fallout the next item i picked up from tj maxx is this super cute ghosty makeup brush holder this was $4 $4.99 so five bucks for a ceramic <laughs> makeup brush holder they did have a cauldron one that had the moon phases on it but i left that there because i really only need one makeup brush holder and i thought this one was super cute they had this a couple years ago and i didn't get it so i definitely decided i needed to pick it up this year so from walmart i picked up a horror shirt walmart is good for horror shirts i found this exorcist one if they have exorcist ones i'm gonna pick them up this one's super good with the Pazuzu statue and then the classic iconic at the gateway of the house. Very cool. Love this. This was $8. Next, I found this Halloween 2 NECA collectible. I think they're like figurines in here. I'm not sure. I bought it because I thought it was on clearance, but it wasn't. It was $10, which is the original price, but they had Ren and Stippy ones that were marked as $5. I don't really know. They have universal monster ones of these too that I did have, but then I put back when I saw how much this was. And then Michaels has some of their Halloween out. They have pillows and they have the electric Halloween line out at my Michaels. If you subscribe to this channel, you would have seen that I did a Halloween hunting video where I filmed my Michaels and what they have. So the only thing that I really picked up from it is these little ghosties in the bathtub. I don't know why, man. This is super <laughs> cute. Lord have mercy, I'm about to bust. I just love this. I love it. I think there's going to be other stuff in bathtubs too, but I had to have the ghost and there was only one of them. So I freaked out that like they weren't going to get any more in. So I just picked up, it was $12.99. I don't know. It's going to look cute in my bathroom. So <laughs> then the last thing that I got from Michael's is this massive That's a huge bitch. coffin sign says reversible so this is the plain side and then they give you this other side which is new this year they used to just be one-sided but you can do this side if you want i've been waiting for my michaels to have these for years now and they finally got them so i went and bought it because i'm not missing out on it now that they have it i mean I'm just gonna go ahead and buy it. It was um, a little expensive, but it is a big piece and I'm glad to have it. I just used a coupon on it, but I think it was originally 30 bucks. That's a spicy meatball. It's a big piece of wood and it's reversible now. So I think that's why they upped it. I mean, what are you gonna do? I want it. I'm scared when I come back, they're not gonna have any. So I just bought it. And then my mom found some Halloween things for me at a thrift shop. So the first thing she found is this super cute ghosty tea light. Um, he has like springs for hands and he's holding a little bucket that says boo. I don't really want to unwrap him because he is 
going to be out for Halloween and Halloween alone, but he is a little tea light holder. He was originally from Kohl's, I don't know when, but $16.99 for this, but he's cute furry Halloween decoration. Then she also sent this really cute jack-o'-lantern jack tea light holder. Put the tea light in there and it lights up the jack-o'-lantern. This is brand new, new with tags. I don't know where it was originally from, but it's really cute. And then the last thing that my mom sent me that was Halloween related is this old Jack Lantern shirt. I don't know, maybe she found it from that. I'm pretty sure this was somebody's She's been going through stuff at their house and finding a bunch of stuff. So yeah, cute. I would never <laughs> buy one of these Jack Lantern shirts, but now that I have one, like I got it gifted to me. It's cute. I'll wear it. Yeah, that is my little teeny Halloween haul for you guys. Comment down below your favorite item that I showed off in this haul. And thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Follow me on other social media. My links will be posted in the description box down below. Hit that notification bell so you guys know when I upload. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.